A very warm welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast show on the Africa Channel. This is Expresso and what a joy it's been to start off our Tuesday morning with uh, Mesa Tola who's been entertaining us with beautiful music, great sounds, Thank inspiring you. sounds. Everyone's loving it. Thank you. Thank you. So, so whereabouts did you come around your love for music and deciding that you're actually going to be doing this as, as a profession, as uh, something that you want to be doing, I guess, for the rest of your life? Wow. Well, it comes from my family, firstly. We come from a musical family. My sister is here with me on the show today. My brother is a musician in Indonesia. Wow. Yeah, Jonas Satoli. And our father, as well, was a musician when he was younger. So we grew up around music. We love music. It's our heartbeat. Was there any talk of a family band happening at some point? We've tried to pull that <laughs> off, but for now, it's in the kitchen while we're making dinner over Christmas. Yeah, we sing together. Yeah. Uh, one of the songs on my upcoming EP, which will be released next year, uh -huh. um, is had my brother will feature on that as All well. Right. Yeah, so that's going to be exciting. So uh, just quickly take me into that home kitchen yes. while it's Christmas and you all are cooking. Yeah. How do you decide who takes which vocal parts? Like who's got the melody, who's got the harmony, <laughs> who takes the bass? How does yeah. that work? Well, that depends on the song, you see. Sam and our sister Laura, who's also a great singer, Laura likes to sing alto, Sam normally high soprano, I'm somewhere in the middle, and Jonah, of course, brings in the R&B oh, flavor. Jonah's like, yes. yeah, 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 <laughs> oh, charisma. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, now we exactly. feel like that's a beautiful Christmas to share as a family. And I was yes. wanted to ask, with also uh, you traveling so much and yeah. having lived with your parents as diplomats, is there one country that you feel influenced your music the most? Hmm, that's a tough one. Yeah? I think everywhere I go, a little bit of that country yeah. has rubbed off on me. Um, so in Ethiopia, I love that so much, and they have this groovy dance, which I, I now do sometimes. It's like a shoulder dance. They do this. Okay. And they have, yeah, and yeah, the women okay. are just so gorgeous, yeah. you know, and I like to in <laughs> include groovy beats in our music. Taki and Kwezi will tell you. Um, but also Zimbabwe, where I'm from, the guitars, the mbira, has influenced our music a lot as well. Mm -hmm. um, and here in South Africa, the house beat, you guys know how to get down oh, and that. have fun. Oh, okay, and fantastic. So, yeah, all of that has influenced it. And other places as well. Senegal yeah. has some amazing music. Mm -hmm. Came across the African harp there and the kora and... Oh, mm, mm, so mm. much richness and diversity on this continent. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, we're all looking forward to seeing what you're going to be, de be delivering in your music career going forward. Thank and you. of course, if you'd like to follow that journey, do follow May on social media at Mesa Tola. Right now, you're about to perform yes. a song called Jiva. Yeah. Let's get down there. Get down with us. <laughs> <laughs> 